Welcome back to further gameplay with Captain Jawline. Um. Very good, Paddle. Oh, well. You've cleared the way. What I have. About? <laughs> I needed this tomb raised, and now that I have what I need, you're of no use to me. So that's. That's. Can you reverse what she's done. Mm. Thanks. Hope this new encryption keeps her out for good. Hmm. Yeah, because she hacked into my comms. But I was going to say, I don't really remember much about... God, the assassination thing is always so brief. About the previous episode. Wow, that's pretty. Um, but I do remember we fought... This is like the second sister or whatever her name was. And then we met the general or they were the same person. I don't remember. Um, but she's the one who's pretty much telling us, hey, you're screwed. Um, I'm trying to screw me over and stuff like that. So, and she's been hacking into my comms and stuff. A pro droid processing unit. Wasn't really it's nice. Like hacking other droids anyway. But now we're just kind of moving yeah, on. Weird about hacking people we just too. finished this for whole tune. Right? It was a rainy tomb that took me to way too long to be. I remember that. I don't know what that did. I can control damaged Imperial probe droids. Interesting. Skrilla probably knows where they are. <laughs> you sure the comms fixed? They're not answering. Oh, pulling. Something's wrong. We need to get back. Yeah, because I can pull and push now. Forgot about that. Return to my mantis. She did say she doesn't need me anymore, which is pretty sus. Uh, gonna need... The mantis is my main ship. So... I'm pretty sure she did something to my Play ship. Around. Think it's some kind of trap? How could they do Seems this like to me? A lot of them lately. Wait, do you hear that? No. You hear what? Oh, is this where my ship is supposed to be? Because there's nothing there. Nope. Uh, we're going... Oh, it's all the way over there. Oh, that is... A spicy meatball. They expect me to go all the way over there? I thought this might be, like, lead to a clue or something. Ah. Uh, shortcut my butt. Oof. Well, they definitely want me going this direction, then. <clears throat> Stungus. Stungus, get out of here. I I genuinely thought he said Stungus. Oh. I can pull this now. Is that significant? Can I go get a collectible or something? Uh. No. Is your answer? Because I would presume I can grab some new collectible or the such. But uh, not seem to be the case. One sec, I'm gonna check this out. Aha! Okay, so I could climb it. To the far. That actually scared me. God, getting back into it, and it's already this much of a hassle. So, I mean, I completely forgot how to play this game somewhat, but the mechanics are somewhat similar to... Um, what's it called? Uh, ninja game samurai uh, brain? I can't remember. Yep, there you go. Ghost of Tsushima. Like, B is for the controller, B is the uh, dodge, and it, it feels very Ghost of Tsushima. And like, the block button's the same. I wanna, I'm want i curious which came out first, but. I think this might be a lift to the lower floor. Oh. That'd be good for heading but back. Either way, they're very similar with like feel, I get with combat feel, and I didn't really compare it before. But I've been playing a lot of Ghost of Tsushima after I beat uh, some other games a little while ago. So, 
it's like it's it's easier to get a hold of than last time. Oh, I've never done that before. I love that. Ow. Ah. I don't know how to feel about this. No, you do. Oh, really? No, I don't. Let's look. No, I don't. What? Oh, it's deflector. Imperial astromech droid. Huh, that's what they're called. Deflect it right at your face. Your face has been destroyed. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Wrong way. It is the wrong way. So we took the elevator. It clearly is showing me that the elevator... Ooh, slice this. I think I got this upgrade at some point. Shortcut unlocked. Hi, BD. Oh, so cute. Hey, BD. Do not concern yourself with a missing artifact. I'll deal with it personally. Oh. Ooh, this is a spawn point. Okay, I don't need to rest, aka spawn in all the enemies I just defeated. But, it's good to have a close by spawn point. So, I don't think there's going to be a lot to like plot wise. Uh, but I'll check back in if something pops up, other than just me trekking all the way back. Okay, I just had to go all the way down to the ice caves. Just to friggin' get back, which we'll talk about that later. But all of a sudden, this dude called Brunzi came out of nowhere. Like, what the heck's your deal? You bean man, bean man. Oh no! No 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 no! What the heck? Wait, but, uh, what? He took out that much of my health? And hey, where did this guy come from? Uh. What is happening? I try to get back. This bounty hunter guy knocks me out in a couple shots. And then we have a cinematic? What? This is actually kind of surprising. I did not expect this. Oh, buddy. Where are you? I only started recording again. BD? Like, resumed recording because I had this, like, bounty hunter guy was here. Why are we... out of here. Wherever here is. Like, this is completely... Completely unexpected. Um... Trilla lured into a hanging sarcophagus. So I guess I had to go down the ice caves just to go back, which is frustrating because this place is a labyrinth, this entire planet. And I I guess it was for story matters, but it, it gets a little bothersome to try to figure out where to go and examining your map. Like you're on the friggin' road trying to figure out which highway gets where. Uh, I'm just reading this while I'm talking. Bounty hunter. So it was a bounty hunter. The bounty hunter did kick my butt. Uh, what do I do with this? What? Oh, 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 right. I can lift stuff. Do I plug this in somewhere? So I don't have a lightsaber back there I whoever locked me up took my lightsaber gotta get it back okay well I'm trying to mr. oh I get it now I figured it out my big brain has evolved here's cold stale so I assume I was supposed to get captured by that bounty hunter because I was doing relatively well and then all of a sudden he just did an unavoidable move I feel like you could have beaten him Ugh, gross. I feel like it's possible. I like this little Easter egg. Possible to have beaten him, but um. Ugh. 
But at the same time, I'm not 100% sure because I know... Gross. I, I love this. It's not an Easter egg. Okay, I'm going to correct that. I love it whenever they put stuff like they don't necessarily have to do, like all of this extra detail. Um, but they they sometimes do that in a lot of games where it's like you can't avoid it. Even if you win, you lose kind of thing. There's a lot of those situations. I don't know what I just did. So, yeah. What did this turn into Puzzle Manor? What the heck? What, what, what is supposed to be happening here, huh? I did something. It's a chain reaction. I don't have a lightsaber. So it's going to be pretty deadly if I accidentally let something out. What? What? I don't know what's happening. Oh! Well, actually, I should plug this in for... Whenever I get my BD-1 back, I can just use the scomp. I can get the scomp. I genuinely don't know if I did that right, but I'm going to leave it. It's always good to leave stuff for future reference. That's my saying. Because see if I can find a way out of here. in like most games, I usually, if I'm like, if I can solve a puzzle, even if it doesn't do anything, I'll solve it. Because, especially with Legend of Zelda, if you solve a puzzle in like a dungeon and come back to it, whenever you're like Looks able like to access watch. it, aka like what I did now where I, where you hit a power or something like that, and then the power turns on and the puzzle's already solved, and bada bing bada boom, these are entirely gross. They're like giant friggin' wobbly maggots. Oh no, no, it's that thing. The give me the heebie jeebies. Heebie jeebies, I love beebies. I love BBI. That's oh. not good. Why not? Those giant spider things are getting thrown down. I like that. Oh, uh, I got a lock. I like it a lot. Uh, nope, that's a shortcut. And uh, I go back here. I will say, the motion blur is kind of giving me a little sick because I do have to look around a lot. And I've noticed it in BD1. BD, BD1. Yeah. Is that you? I've noticed it in you. other playthroughs okay? on this, but it, it just Get genuinely makes me a little sick. So it's not—it's not like it's new or anything. It's just—it's um, just I, I tolerate it. Uh, that's so weird. What am I supposed to be doing? So I take this. Can I drag it all the way back here? No. I know that was a scomp link. I just wanted to see. Oh, I can swing on it. I have not once been able to swing on a power cord before, so I don't know how I was able to, supposed to figure that out. I guess just that leap of faith. I was like, this thing, I can walk on the wall, right? And then just boom. All of a sudden, I'm, I'd be swinging. But it would be. Oh, what was that noise? Hey. Little buddy, you really made a freaky oh, noise. Happy to see you too. Snap his neck. Let's get that restraining bolt off of you. Restraining bolt? That's an interesting Jerks. thing they made. I guess it stops him from connecting to things? Let's get out of here before the same happens to us. It's the DD, the droid dungeon. Droid dungeon, droid jail. Uh, the Haxian brood, we do want to separate it. One of the droid prison cell. I like how it's just called droid jail. You're going to droid jail. Open, please. Thank you. Look easy. There's a thing down there. I don't think I'll be able to get to it anytime soon. But. I mean, if this was a whole plot point, I'm just thinking, if this is a whole plot point, I I, I do think no matter what, whether you face you another bounty hunter, if you can beat the previous one, or, or you had to lose, I like... This thing needs your overcharge. I don't think Thanks, there would be a possible way to avoid getting caught. It's got power now. 
Like whether, yeah, whether it means that you win or whenever it's bleh, 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 bleh. where I, when it. Ah. One sec, I'm gonna formulate my sentence. Brain power, go. Okay, so whether you win or lose against that particular okay, bounty hunter, and you have to face another like one, or it's just you can't win against that one. I feel like that being here was inevitable. Because they wouldn't cut out this entire I section. I recognize this band. Oh no. Yeah, they definitely wouldn't cut this out. I was gonna save using my skill points, but like... Why would I now? We're about to go into the arena. Probably get my lightsaber back. So... Ooh. Ooh, yes! Stim potency. This also, delay thrust, I'm very tempted at some point. Because if you've ever played a combat game, including Devil May Cry, Bayonetta, I guess even um, just anything that uses a sword pretty much, this game I guess is included but goes to Tsushima, you can unlock moves where you can delay attack, like hit, freeze, hit, even God of War does it. And it's honestly super effective and, add, and adds a lot to be discovered for more movesets. Devil May Cry and Bayonetta are the best types, but... I do want to know. I'm Zook Tormo, baby. This feels I like I don't know as as we get out of here. if we if this was like a guy already pre-showed in like comics or whatever, but this feels like a straight-up rip from a Thor or Guardians of the Galaxy thing. It's all Disney now, but. Give baby the toy. Oh, bugs. Yo. Oh, my my toy. That's what he meant. I smell beans. I hate this guy. No. No. This guy. I do not like him. Oh, no. Okay, I'm like half focusing. Ow. Because if I get locked in an animation, I can't block. And parrying is pretty essential in this one. I like to play rough. Keep me my leather outfit. Tsunami? It like, it's, it's like a mixture of... English and some other languages, which are down and face me typically fictional languages <laughs> to mix, like Minion language. Minion language is definitely a mix of multiple languages. They've even like actually given like a little thing of it for it. Hello, ho, ow, I It's not like it's bad to use health because it's not like I'm gonna get it from slashing. Oh no. So I can push them and they will just bada boom. Ooh, okay, so I mean this is just pretty much what it is for now. I don't I don't have any commentary. It's a, it's a, hi, there's some commentary. Big boy. Big boy, big boy, big boy, big boy, big boy, big boy, big boy. What a strike from the Jedi. Ha! Hello, big boy. How you doing? I don't like that. No 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 no. This feels like it's a friggin' it's Episode one, where oh, what? It, oh, cool. Where uh, Obi Wan and Anakin have to fight in an arena. It might have been episode two. Ha 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 I like though how I could just deflect the spider. That was nice. That was a nice little touch. Like, cause I faced these guys before. No. 
no, 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 no. What? No. Oh, it's him. It's that dude. Hello. You think I'm going to play fair? You're literally a bounty hunter. Yeah, I'm not going to play fair. I'm going to beat you up. You made me lose, and now I'm kind of ticked. I'm not happy with you. Thanks, PD. Who needs honor when you're a Jedi? I don't care if Jedi are supposed to be like space samurai where they have honor and stuff. I have no honor when it comes to Jedi. If I'm like Ghost of Tsushima where I'm going to be a samurai, I'll, I'll use some honor, but... I don't know. I think it is kind of odd how if you think about it, a lot of, which I think they've already said this outright, a lot of hey, Star Greece. Wars stuff is just like, you're famous down there. Space samurai with a coat of honor and stuff like that. They smell like used droid oil. So a lot of stuff <laughs> around Jedi right? revolve yeah. around like Japanese tradition. Luckily we found you. We have another complication. The Empire knows about the holocron. Oh no. no good. The entire mission is now at risk. And I had a nice chat with the second sister. Mm -hmm. Trilla. I will say the mocap acting friggin' gorgeous. The actors are doing she great. Tell you? She told me or rendering. She told me you betrayed her to the Empire. I don't know if is it's it mocap or if it's like actual animation, but I would assume it's mocap. She was my apprentice. Hmm. Before the purge. You should have told me. We're getting an encrypted message from Kashyyyk. Oh, we're going back there? I'm... I just... If you gave me one large planet, I kind of would enjoy it more than going back... That's not going all. from planet to planet and being like, oh, this is amazing, then going back to a previous planet, then going back to a previous planet, unlocking more and more and little. Some of us have joined the Wookiee fighters in the forest. Because, like... Be careful. You too. I've had more enjoyment going over all of Arkham in the Arkham games, even in Gotham Knights, Later. than just going Later. back and forth between environments. Yeah, release. That's why people, even in Minecraft, stick to like one environment for a while. The thing is gonna be fine. For a while is what I mean. It's just like I don't know. I get that it appeases like ADHD okay. brains, but. And my and you usually would Can appease my brain, but not I, not too much in this case. Can we talk? Don't talk to me. I don't me. know what's going on between you and her. I mean, I figure it's some kind ah, of Ah, fine. Jet, talk to me, because you're pretty awesome. I don't think this is the right time for it's it. It's not any of your business. Business. I think it's my business. And it really is. We're together, aren't we? Yeah. You better not disrespect him. Hey, Cal. He is opening up to you, and he does not deserve any disrespect. I made a and I almost got you killed. And he is hurting. I'm sorry. And I want to give him a hug. I mean, we all it makes me make genuinely mistakes, sad. Right? <laughs> well, maybe not you. <laughs> hey, why don't you cut her some slack? I'm not saying do it for me, but you two are the best thing that ever happened in my life. Oh. Before you came along, all I cared about was a tight hand on a stiff eater. That's a game term. I know what it is. <laughs> I know what it is. Cal, life's not a game. Before you two, all I cared about was myself. Easy. I think it kind of helps it being Star Wars that I can play this no, and not different. really connect to the story too much and the characters I can be like oh I feel bad and stuff but not really care too much because I, again I'm not a huge I've said this before but I'm not a gigantic Star Wars fan I know a lot about it because I grew up with it but that doesn't mean I have to be a fan um I don't think it's bad I just again not a huge fan. So it helps me kind of have a Cordova disconnect. Hidden all over because Could if... Be worth a trip back to explore. Oh, oh, there is... Okay, so there is one more planet that I assume is going to be a while. 
but what I meant was the humidity. It's like when you have a disconnect with something, then you can you play it with casual nature. But if you love something, especially if it's like a long game, you pr oh, yeah, probably no, prefer to play it on your own time to care about it. No which is why I want to play like Ghost of Tsushima on my own time. I love it. It's helping me. I really care about it. It's helping me like learn and stuff like that as well. But Captain, I am slightly troubled by your enthusiasm. But I will. I would obviously and kind of have play games I very much connect on on a personal level and love them. But, I mean, you can even see them in, like, large YouTubers like Jacksepticeye and Markiplier. If they play something they connect to on a personal level, they go quiet and just kind of enjoy the experience. Where are we headed? No, 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 wait. I gotta sit in the cockpit. I gotta sit in the dick pit. The dick zoo. Dick hole. No. Cockpit is one word, so I don't think you can synonym it to be, like, not sounding right. Because then it wouldn't be a synonym. What am I doing? Meet Tarful and Mari on Kashyyyk. Where? Where? Wait, is Tarful and Mari my buddies? If you're not ready to leave, don't bother me. What? Oh, what? I'm on Kashyyyk, my man. Where am I going? Let's figure it out. Normally, I wouldn't waste my time with the likes of insurgents. But I'm looking for a Jedi Padawan. And I know he's been here. And for that, all of you will suffer. Oh. Oh my gosh, the rebels really got overtaken. That is not good. Oh no. Hey guys. Oh, now you're gonna put on my map. Ah, oh, well, that's great. That's lovely. Lovely. Okay, so if I take the tram, it'll be quick as a pickle. I don't know, I just all of a sudden. That's the thing. People can call it like goth or whatever all they want, but My Chemical Romance like made a generation of music and it was glorious. And so many people know My Chemical Romance when they don't even like the band. I mean, heck, my favorite band Seether even made the, uh, one of the songs for the Daredevil movie, and people hate the heck out of that movie. And I don't even know why. That is a good movie. And I refuse to say it's not. Because it is. I went to uh, a certain store, secondhand store, and I love shopping secondhand stores. I found so many issues of dead, not dead, of uh, Daredevil, like the old movie and I forgot the main actor. I was trying to think of him, but Christian Bale, I don't think so. Um, but they had so many issues with Daredevil. It was like the special now, edition with like the nice feeling cover. Sir gave me your calm frequency. I didn't grab right. it at the time okay? just because I know I can I'm go sick. back and probably grab one any time. The There's so many. Did Mariana give you our rendezvous coordinates? Like, she did. I'm come on. on. What do you... Good. We're just reaching them now, but we can't stay long. There's some the pretty Empire bad movies out there. Us. Daredevil's I'll be not there one as soon as I can. Hey, uh, I'll be there soon. Aha, I see you. Stay close, Petey. 
Those things look fast. They look speedy. Put it down. Oh my gosh, what are you? They are pretty speedy. Oh my gosh. I don't even have any projectiles. Good scan, BD. I've seen the gameplay of the, the newest game where it has some projectiles, so I don't know if if I get the gun in this one, or if that is a um, an only next game thing. No! Ah! Oops! They're coming out like dude, I swear we saw him. He didn't just fall into the abyss. Oh no! Oh gosh. Away with you! No survivors! Shoot him! Yeah, do it, I dare you. If you can hit me. They can. You probably won't be able to. Because you go into the abyss. There's another dude down there. Oh, so this is just a whole new place. Okay. I thought this was kind of like a shortcut opened up. But no, 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 no. Whole new place. Oh, uh, no! What's up, nerd? I don't know if I was supposed to just avoid his thing, but... I need some help. Okay, so... I think he's probably the... Yep! Yeah, he was the uh, big blast boy. That's what I was curious. Because if he wasn't, if he was like the Gatling guy, I could easily deflect it while running. But, ooh. No deflection. See, I will say this about uh, here. It's like, they at least try to, from distance, like minimally render well, depending on how high performance. So it's like, since I have like this on relatively high, like medium, the save point even loads still, which is a really nice little touch. Mari, are you there? I'm almost. It's always lines. like at the wreck of a walker. Two criticisms, so one out but one Is really high appraise no, with this game. And it's mostly my bias with Star Wars. Okay. Another AT AT thing. Yeah. It's always going to be my bias with certain games because, like, I like a lot of crappy games and just like a lot of good ones. But it's always the. Uh, Appeal of the genre that usually gets me. Yeah! No! No, no, no! BD, stim. I literally can't do anything. I can climb this. I can't fight anymore. Yeah, I don't appreciate your missiles, sir. How about just self combust? Come bust on your face. Can I guess them BD1? Just in time. Okay. Where are you going? Little man. <laughs> no, 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 please. Not you. Anyone but you. I despise you and all your kind. Fall. Never recover. Okay, so what are we scanning? What are we doing? What are we doing? Find something? Do? I don't want this episode to go on too long. So actually, we're gonna... Ooh, Thanks, a Wookie. Oh, this is the Wookiee Homes! Oh my, how did I not know this? Literally, if you've ever even played Force Unleashed, like, I, I know some people who are not Star Wars fans at all, and they know at least Force Unleashed, and the starting intro of the first game is you're destroying Wookiee Homes as Darth Vader. Like, how did I not recognize this? And it's Kashyyyk, it's Wookiee Planet. Completely forgot. Well, I'm a fool, and as the fool, we're going to finish here. Uh, so this episode's not too long and I can render it easily, but, and also editing's uh, a whole hassle. So, um, I'll see you guys later, and I hope you enjoyed coming back to this, because I do every time, honestly.